In 1994, a ton of different lures hit the infomercial market. One of those lures was this guy right here, the helicopter lure, which I'm in the process of doing a video on right now. Their other lure that came around around the same time was this guy, the Banjo Minnow, with over 2 million kits sold, and it actually was the number one lure for two years straight. I actually did a poll on the Banjo Minnow like a couple months ago, and one of the community members, John, thank you so much, he's like, hey, I bought a bunch of these off of eBay a couple years ago, I will send you some. They have evolved over the years, so a lot of what you see out there now that is touted as the Banjo Minnow isn't the original version. So let me show you how to hook them up, let's read through some of the packaging, because I think it's kind of a hilarious to read and then we're gonna have the lake see if we can actually catch some bass on them i love reading marketing from like 1994 the most lifelike fishing lure ever created the banjo minnow is never reeled in or pulled in it is retrieved with a series of quick short jerks always move the rod tip back toward the bait after each jerk and pause this creates slack line and allows the bait to be inhaled the pause may be a second or many seconds we don't really know. To make the bait swim, use a succession of three or four very quick jerks in a rhythm. The bait must never travel further than two feet on any jerk. Not intended for children under 13 years of age. So sorry, folks. You are not allowed to fish with this bait. You're under 13 years of age. Uh, let me show you how to hook this bad boy up. I got a couple colors. Ooh, I like that one. Probably that guy as well. Probably will not be using this guy because I really don't fish with unnatural colors. Now this one is a little bit different than this one. I know this is the original version, so this might be an evolution of it because it's a really thick, fat head on that. And let's talk about hooking this thing up. This is probably why this particular lure got phased out. There's like so many parts to the hook. So essentially what you need is it comes with the hook. This one's weighted and you can stick this corkscrew on the end. Uh, there's a weed guard, also known as if you had braces. <laughs> in the 90s. This is what you used. Oh, these are all like congealed together. Probably because, oh yeah, yeah. Probably because they're from 1994. So basically stick that up there, hook it onto the barb, and there it is. Weed guard. And now, all you do, banjo minnow. Corkscrew that through the head. And that, my friends, is how you hook up the banjo minnow. Bass comes up behind it. Got him. All right, so let's head out to the water to see if this bad boy is a gimmicky type of lure and it's not gonna catch anything, or if it's just overhyped. Because in my opinion, it looks like it would catch fish, right? This thing going through the water looks like a minnow, looks like a lot of my other soft plastics, just kind of a different kind of setup for it. But I think I can catch some bass on this bad boy. There's a stump, right? Nice log, underwater log. I don't know if you guys can see that, but if I was a fish, I'd be held up. Right against it, right there. Let's try it again. Got him. I knew he was there. <laughs> Come here. Nice one. Nice one. There we go. It's a long one. Banjo minnow fish. <laughs> they do catch fish. <laughs> Got another one. The banjo. Come here. And I'm only in three feet, 2.8. There we go. Got him. On the banjo. <laughs> Look at that. This juicy business right here. Juicy business. There's probably 100 fish sitting in here. Okay, I don't know what I'm talking about, but there are a lot of bass sitting in this way down here. There's another one. <laughs> Pop, pop, pop. Tap, 
tap tap. Little short jerks. Boom. Gotcha. Oh, that's a nicer one. That's a nicer one. Oops, that's not fighting like a bass. Is it a bass? It is. Ooh. <laughs> there we go. There we go. Look at that. Look at that. Not bad. Not bad. Oh, yeah, it's the last second. <laughs> I was reeling in, get ready to cast again. There we go. Banjo OG. So that banjo minnow might just be a little overhyped, but I don't know, I was putting some bass into yak. But uh, if you guys love retro lures from 1994, I got another one for you. The helicopter lure that many say caught more fishermen than fish. You can check out that video right here, guys. Thanks for watching, see ya.